Hello, this is Mickey and Travis from Tennessee. This is our 2012 Xterra Pro 4X, and we have a little problem. We got some Cooper STTs and 30570R16, and we have a rubbing problem. I'll try to get in here and let you see. If you can see, put your point to that. It's rubbing right there. So we got on the forums and talk, they talked about doing a melt mod, so we're going to try to do that today, see how well it comes out. As you can see, there's a, a ridge right here that forces the plastic to come up here. And this is a thermoplastic, and when you heat it up, it gets malleable, and then when it cools, it hardens again. So you can do the trick of using a heat gun, which we have right here, to make it malleable reshape it in the form that you want it, let it cool down, and it'll stay there. So that's what we're going to try. Go ahead. Protect the tires. They're expensive. It doesn't take very long with a heat gun. It's very fast. So be careful because if you heat it up too much, the uh, it'll become too liquid and it'll tear. You want to hold it in place until it cools into its new shape. That ridge is gone now, so that it's not pushing the plastic out. It's actually in, and then we're going to give it a couple of. Going to have to go in right there. Right there. Okay. There we'll do a little bit more. The metal under here has a has a um, folded over piece right here where this is attached, and if it's rubbing against that, you can just take your hammer like we did on the other side, smack this a little bit with the hammer, and it bends that inside a little bit. You can't even tell it on the outside at all.
gonna use the little bit of hot there and hammer kind of stick. Okay. Well, you can see when it cools back down, it stays whatever shape that you want. But you have to be really, really careful not to get it too hot because your hammer or whatever you're pushing will actually go all the way through it and make a tear because it just it just turns into liquid. And be sure you don't get it against the paint in here. Right, the paint will just completely come off. Last one here, if this will pop in. Okay. Yeah. You can feel that right there, and give it a couple of whacks. You can feel it again, and that bends it. It's very easy to bend. It bends it in this angle, and so that also helps to push that plastic up and out of the way. And that's it. It takes just a few minutes. Oh, you keep the camera. I don't hold on. Thank you.